He is a grave digger at Greenwood Cemetery in Brooklyn, where the days are long and exhausting. Sometimes, Ali Maoud arrives as early as 3 a.m. and stays late just to lessen the load for the next day. Sometimes I do uh, 14, 15 hours a day. And it's, it's very excruciating. During normal times, it is back-breaking work. But these days, what hurts more than the body is the soul. During this pandemic, he's been moved to the crematory, where he performs 20 cremations a day. That's 20 grieving families he has to watch every day because of COVID, grieving and mourning from a distance. It's very hard. Very hard to actually witness how family members are sitting down just to say goodbye to somebody that they're never going to see again. We haven't seen anything like this. Even, even September 11th wasn't like this. I mean, that was a shock, a one-time event. This is just continuing. It's um, calm sadness is overtaken the place. The backlog here is so overwhelming that even if by tomorrow the number of deaths fell to zero, they would have to work here at this grueling pace for an entire month just to clear that backlog. The volume of burials and cremation have just been astounding. Burials are more than twice the norm. Cremations is three times the norm and we can't keep up. As for Maud, Every time he lays a soul to rest, he thinks about his wife and nine-year-old daughter with asthma and worries about getting them sick. But when he looks out at this place, a place where most of us see death, he sees something else. I still see life when people come in here. Families and people actually come to gather in this place. It's, a, it's something for them to say, I still remember who you are and I'm still here with you. In Brooklyn, Safan Kim, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.